Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to High Pixel Skyblock on my little profile here. So, in that short little time I was offline, I managed to make a little bit of progress. I got both of these redstone minions to level 2. And I think I'm going to get some storages for them, because that's not a lot of storage space. And, you know, that's like a boring thing to watch. I just got to go over here, right? Over to these logs. And I gotta mine a ton of wood. And I don't want you guys to sit through that. That's just mean of me. So, I reckon that I'll cut out here. And I'll come back shortly when I'm done. Alright? See you in a second. Alright, hey guys, I'm back. And so this is the little loot I got. I got an axe, obviously. And I got seven small storages. I probably didn't need that many, but I got them. And I got a ton of apples because I'm using a sweet axe. Which is pretty cool. I can sell those for a little bit of money. And I got some spare logs. Wait, what the heck? Okay. And I got some spare logs. So, I'll just go sell these. And then we can go place down a few of these storages. On my minions. slower than I thought I was. And, uh, you, you, you. And cobblestone. Alright, so just head back to my island with my small storages. Place one here. One here. And one here. The storage is not full. I just gave you more. Ooh, hang on, that's actually good. I can put that in iron minions to get iron collection. Iron collection is really useful. Iron collection is useful because of the hoppers, of course, the budget and enchanted food and the enchanted hopper and the personal deleter. Those are both very useful. And redstone is good because of the accessory bag slots and the personal compactors, which personal compactors are very useful. I use them so much. Alright, so, we're gonna head out here, and I think my aim today, hmm, what skyblock level am I? Oh yeah, I got the skyblock level 3 while I was mining, by the way, which was pretty cool, while I was foraging, so I can go talk to Elizabeth now, and start some profile upgrades, so I guess I'll do that. Hey, Elizabeth, we'll upgrade... Minion slots is usually a good one. We'll start that. Take an hour a day. And then I've already got that going. My profile upgrade. My account upgrade, whatever. Which is pretty good. Right, how much money have I got? 75k. Hmm. I need to make some money. And I think I know what I need to do. Let me show you. I need some sticks. Gotta go talk to this guy. You. And I need to buy two sticks. And I'm going to make... A gold axe. Ooh, while I'm thinking about it actually... So what we're going to do is we're going to come over this way and we're going to talk to this guy. This guy's the carpenter. You only really need to do this if you have a rank like me. I got MVP plus, as you can see. I mean, you can't see, but like, I've got MVP plus. Plus. No, just plus. So, we talk to the carpenter and then we grab some money because I need more money. That'll do. And then we head over this way to these guys. And we ignore the builder because you're stupid. And we go talk to the wool weaver. And we just wait for a dialogue. And then we buy a stack of white wool here for 2048 coins. And I head back over to the carpenter because he asked for wool. A stack of white wool. That's what I've got. 
And then, he's gonna give me some stuff, some more dialogue. And now, I can earn this carpentry XP, which means that I can unlock quick crafting, which is just good. It makes me not sad, because crafting is boring. Right, and now this, I want to put... Oh, I'm gonna need to make my own enchantment table, actually. So I'm gonna need some books from you. And I'm gonna need two diamonds. I'm gonna have to go to the mines to get two diamonds. Give us a second. Alright, we are now at the mines, and I just gotta go over here. And I just gotta mine. Oh, that went into the lava. Okay, I just gotta mine two of these. And, okay, well, I got extra. Now I can leave. And I need some obsidian. Can you buy obsidian? I actually don't know if you could buy obsidian. If you build that, we can't. Okay, just need to change this place. The fire will do. Alright, and then we gotta craft one of these. Enchantment table. And I'm actually gonna go over here. And mine some logs. So I can craft some bookshelves. Let's pretend that's enough for now. I don't need a lot. Uh, I can remember how to make these. Yeah, 21 is the decent amount. Right, I head to my island. And... Actually, I want more wood. I'm gonna make this look nice. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to make a nice looking island. Because previous islands on my account haven't looked great. And I want to change that. So I want to try and make a less basic island. And for that, I'm going to need slabs. And a lot of them. Cool. Alright, so I craft all of this into planks. Because... Why not? And then, slabs. Cool. I head back to my island. Where do I want everything to sell off? This island or that one? That one. First, I'm actually going to build this bridge a little bit wider just because... I don't need to be falling off into the void. And then I'm going to build my enchanting table out this way, I reckon. And yes, I'm going to bridge over my own island. Get your table there. And build these out to here. Maybe? I don't really know. I need to build this. So I'm just gonna make it up. Oh, I got my F3 from the table, didn't it? Can't reach that yet. my table. Okay, what's my bookshelf power looking like? Is it five? It is. Okay. I'm actually still going to need to talk to the librarian so I can grab some enchanting 
puddles of enchanting. These guys. Got two stacks of that. So I can enchant my axe with all of the things I need. So this is not going to be a long-term money-making method, because there's obviously going to be much better ones very shortly. But it is going to be my current money-making method, because it works, and it's fun, kind of, a little bit, not really. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go this way, just through past all of this hub wheat, because we're not that poor anymore, and we're going to go to the farming islands. Once again, ignoring the barn, because the barn is stupid. Stupid island. No one farms here, ever. I'm gonna head here. And we're going to go this way. I think this is how you get down. I actually don't remember. So we're gonna go this way. And yes, down here. And we're gonna take this efficiency 5 silk touch axe and we're just gonna mine this. Yep. That's that's what we do. We just mine these mushrooms. And it's actually decent for money. Especially if you don't have a lot of money. Like me. Very, it's very cheap to start doing. Okay, I fell. And you just mine these. That's all you do. And eventually, when you get enough collection, you can get the enchanted blocks and you just turn them into the enchanted mushrooms and then you turn them into the enchanted blocks and that's all you gotta do and it actually makes decent money so i reckon i'll get back to you in what time is it okay i'll get back to you in 10 minutes in 10 minutes we'll see what we got all right let's go so it hasn't been very long but we just got a farming level up a little update So I just got the recipe. Wait, where is it? Here. And you just craft them like this. Here's the enchanted red mushrooms. And you see I've already got $28,000. Or coins or whatever. That's all you gotta do. Alright, not the point of what I'm doing right now, but I did just unlock quick crafting. Which means I can just click things here and craft them. Which is just amazing. I love that. Alright, my 10 minutes are up, and this is what I've gotten. So, I can use my little quick crafting thing here. This is what I have. So, let's go sell all this and see how much money I make. Go back to the hub. And first, we're just going to deposit all my coins into my bank account. Right. So all of these mushrooms, and I made two hundred and thirty thousand coins. All right, in ten minutes, with a golden axe. This has no farming fortune on it. This setup has no farming fortune on it. This is the least farming setup you could possibly have, and it makes two million coins an hour. Like. And it costs nothing, it literally. You can go mine three gold. You can grab two sticks from over there. Literally mine one, three things, four things. You can mine four things to get this axe. 
zero coins to start and two million coins per hour. And all you need is a few enchantments. This is a very, very good money making method. And I suggest you try. Alright, anyway, now I've got all of this money. Uh, I'm gonna spend it all on something. What do I want to spend it on? Do I want to spend it on armor or an AOTE? That's a little bit out of my budget. I'm kidding. Okay. Uh, a 56. Wait, hang on. 270k. Oh, wait. These are actually kind of expensive. I mean, I might need to go get some more money. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go get, like, a lot more money, and then I'll come back to you guys. Give me a minute. Alright, and we're back. I've made a decent amount of money. It didn't take very long at all. So just sell all of these. Alright, I have 802,000 coins. Now I'm gonna buy an aspect of the end that actually is good. Hopefully not for too much money, because I also want to buy some armor. Nope. And it's gonna have like a few enchants on it, more than three preferably, more than four. See, this one's good. Alright, 777k. That's like all of my money. That is a lot of money. Eh, I don't care. Oh, hang on. Can you buy end armor? No. no. I gotta get some end armor, but that's actually gonna be free because I gotta get it myself. So, I reckon I go for it, get one of these. Don't want sharp or spicy. This one gives a lot more crit chance. I'll get this one. Uh, yep. Alright, new weapon. Cool, and now I can teleport. Now I can run fast, and teleporting costs 50 mana. I need new armor. I'm actually going to deposit this in the bank real quick. My coins. Right, and I'm going to go get my ender armor after I figure out how much damage I do. Yeah, because this is just strong. I don't think I'll be using the ability very much, though. Alright. Six hundred and... Six hundred and fifty damage. The crit. It's only a 48% crit chance, too. Oh, wait, I'm gonna need combat level 12, aren't I? Ah, oh, okay, I can't even go to the end yet. I better... I'm gonna need to get down to the Dwarven Mines. I might just need to mine some enchanted things, because I don't have Skyblock level 7. Hang on, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna get Skyblock level 7 real quick. I'm gonna look up the fast way to do this and then I'll come back to you. Alright, I've decided I'm gonna do some fairy cells. Let's go. Um. I just remembered I didn't know where fairy cells are. I'll find them. Oh, wait, I have waypoints. I have waypoints. 
Alright, time to go. One. Two. 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 Three. Oh my god. Four. Five. I just realized this one is actually six, so. Seven. There's so many zombies here, bro. Alright, whatever I'm up to. 7, 8, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. That'll do for now. Let's talk to Tia here. And that'll be 30 Skyblock XP. Yeah, the cells of your fallen sisters. Yeah, I know. That'll get me to level 5. And that should be everything. Skyblock level 5, let's go. Ooh, access to garden. Let's go. I was looking for that. Alright, now find some more ways to level up. Alright, I guess skill level ups will work. Alright, need just a little bit more XP to get to the next farming level, so that's very loud. Uh, blocks. There we go. There we go. That was really difficult. I don't know how I got through it all. Sell, 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 sell. Alright. I guess I could do foraging. I think I need a little bit more foraging XP and I'll level up. I also just mine these, I guess, because I'm not going to the park. I'm not that desperate. There we go. There's another level. I could do some basic slayers, I guess. But I don't know if I want to do slayers yet. That doesn't seem like a good idea. It seems a bit too early. I'll do like tier 1 revs, I guess. They're pretty easy. And Maddox. Maddox. You got a name. Zombie. Die, zombie. Oh, I guess I'll get some combat XP from this, too. Alright, I'll just kill a bunch of zombies until I spawn the boss. Alright, last zombie. Here we go. First layer of the profile. And I one-shot him. That's funny. Alright, let's see. Did I get any Skyblock XP for that? What am I at? 48 out of 100. Oh, I can't wait to get the bat phone. I'm just gonna buy one as soon as I start doing more slayers. 15 XP! Wait, that's pretty good. Wait, maybe I should do more slayers. I'll do two more. Yeah, I'll do two more slayers and I'll get to the next level. Alright, Revenant Hunter. Alright, here we go. Oh, one shot. Let's go. Totally didn't expect that because I've already done this boss. This is, this is the bad part. I gotta run back down to Maddox. The slayer, you're a slayer. Smack, smack. 
We're gonna have to loot his underground from killing these zombies. That's crazy. You're next. I'm so cool. Oh. Okay, hi. Oh, I didn't one shot it this time. Oh, not that level up. Let's go. Alright, let's head back to Maddox. Gonna get my final reward for Slayers for the entire profile because I'm never doing Slayers again. Just kidding. <laughs> Twenty. Twenty-five skyblock XP. I'm gonna make the zombie ring. I need a lot more of that. How many zombie talisman? Uh, so I can make the zombie pickaxe now. Uh, zombie talisman? Question mark. I have to look it up actually. You. Oh. Oh yeah, I can buy a ton of things from the adventurer. Okay, let me go talk to the adventurer and let me buy a ton of the talismans he has. Oh, I just need to land up like. 10-ish K. I'm actually kind of running out of money. I might need to go grind mushrooms again. Okay, so free skyblock XP. What would I pick up? Alright, now I've got an entire 18 magical power. I go talk to Maxwell. away. Do the dialogue, of course. Uh, why am I going over here? Oh, I closed the menu. That means I have to go back over to him. I could try and do some collections, I guess. Which one is the best intelligence-wise? Pretty. I'll take the trees. So, I might have to just do a ton of collections. Just get Skyblock XP. I'm gonna just come back to you when I get the level because it's gonna take a while and I'll let you know everything I did. We got it, guys. We got the bazaar. Let's go. That's so good. Because I'm too lazy to collect things of my own. And I got 16k in items. Not bad. Alright. Let's see what's cheapest. Not cobblestone. Uh, 571. Isaac Coles. 667. Gold is good too. 77A. 250. Alright, so. Enchanted redstone. What's the second cheapest? Enchanted coal. No, sorry. Enchanted redstone is the cheapest. Enchanted coal is the second cheapest. And enchanted gold is the third cheapest, I believe. Let's pretend that's correct. I'm going to need 10k. And we'll head down to the Dwarven Mines. Finally. 
Nice. Nope. Imagine. I imagine that the. Imagine I could do that. Look at this noob. What's up, noob? I'm kidding. Hey, Reese. Yeah, I am. Give me a heart, man. Thank you. 35 Skyblock XP. Damn, I should have done that earlier. that at all? No. Don't have a mithrit powder, of course not. Alright, now we gotta go talk to Boo Boo. Yeah, Boo Boo. And I'm gonna grab that one. That one right there. Let's get mithrit pickaxe. Cool. Now, I need to get combat level 12, of course. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go around here. And we're gonna go down this way. And we're gonna head down this way. Yep. And we're gonna go down this way. If you're like me and have a death wish, you can just jump off here. Just kidding. You can go around that way too and around there, or you can just jump. Sometimes you die, sometimes you don't. It really depends on your mood. <laughs> it does not. And then, we want to see this guy, and we want to not talk to him because he looks ugly. And we want to cross the bridge, and we want to go kill these Blaishat walkers. Like this guy, see? Kill the Blaishat walkers. You get 40 combat XP for each one you kill, and you die. You see, because I am such a manly man, <laughs> I don't... I don't do the bow swapping method, and I don't like stand somewhere and be a little scaredy cat. I just go in and smack him. But obviously, you guys don't want to see that, so I'll cut back when I have combat 12. All right, we are back, and I've just gotten combat 12, and somehow I did not drop a single piece of armor, but I did get some jewels, which is pretty cool. It's like 100 100k of jewels ish. So, I guess we'll just head back to the hub, and then we'll try and get some ender armor, after I just sell this. Uh, hang on, let me just fix my mud thing. Wait, hang on. I forgot which one it is. Give me a second. Which mud is it? Okay, you know what? I don't. Oh, oh it's sky honey. Okay, whatever. So we're just gonna head over to the end, and here we are. Talk to this guy. This is a light adventurer, my absolute best friend. Yeah, I need that armor. I can only five of them. All right, what's this skill? I do do enough damage to kill them. I don't really have the gear to survive a hit. But I've got the damage, so I should be alright. <laughs> I just will die a few times. <sighs> Crap. Oh my, okay. I need to stay back a little bit. This is a strat, you just hit him into the wall. <laughs> I'm 
this might take a while. I'll just kill these first five while you guys are here. And then I'll get all the armor off camera. Because I, you don't want to watch that. It's going to take a long time. And I'm going to die a lot. I'm just really bad, I guess. <laughs> the constant deaths are not fun. Alright. Got him. Is that all I need, or do I need one more? Not bad, not bad. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure this is stronger. 100. I'm pretty sure that mine is stronger than yours. Let me just check. 125 damage. Yeah, no, I think this is actually better. Thanks, though. But no, I'm just gonna go kill some Enderman. Until I get the armor. Is Ender armor the best armor I can get right now? I'm not sure. Maybe some Mac Dino Glaze side would actually be better. Yeah, I don't want to fight that, so that's fine, actually. Heh, <laughs> you gotta get me for my D. Screw you. So mean. I really expected to get armor. But I kind of didn't get armor. Like, I expected to get some Glacite armor while getting to combat 12, and I just kind of didn't. So, find these guys with iron armor, and it's not working. I might need to go buy some armor. This is not going well. Alright. I'm just gonna cut out here. I'm gonna cut out here, and I'll cut back in when I get the full armor set, alright? See you soon. Alright, so I was just... I kept dying. I need better armor. So I'm just gonna buy some... Slyre armor? Yes. So we'll raise that up. And I'm going to put this on. I'm going to put it into my wardrobe. And then I'm going to put it on. And this is how I'm going to survive. So, I guess I'll just... See if this works. That's not where I want to go. I want to go to the end. more health and more damage actually yes this is good yes okay I did not put my coins away but this is working so I'll just cut back when I get the armor that I need all right everyone I'm back and you have no idea how long that took let's just say I started grinding that at 1 30 p.m. ish it's now 3.49 p.m. It took a very long time. But I got 120k out of it. From all of these things that I sold. And I got so many pieces that I didn't need. And also there were a ton of dragons being done that I didn't get to do because I was grinding. And a armor. Alright, cool. So now I got all this armor. I'm nice and beefed up. I'm nice and strong now. Let's go do a damage test. And that's a whoa. Alright, so we're going to do them on these hub zombies here. These graveyard zombies. 860 damage. 
440, 860 on a crit. That's pretty good. That's actually really good. But, 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 I think I want, hang on, I want to try something. I want a Dreadlord Sword. Do these have a Catacombs requirement? Ooh, I don't think they, oh, they do. I need Catacombs 3. Alright, cool. Uh, we're going to go vote for mayors, because we got that on right now. Give me a second. Alright, anyway. Click to vote. Alright, starting slayer quest is half price and 20% more red drops. No one's ready for Foxy or Marina. Or Diaz. Scorpius. This is a special can that rarely appears. Scorpius wins and very here. May Scorpius offer you 50,000 toys as a token of gratitude. Ooh. Scorpius will introduce and will intrude in dark options, increasing the amount of rounds to seven and offering special We're voting for Scorpius. You voted for this candidate, yeah. No shit, shower. I'm assuming that's who everyone else is going to be voting for. As well, because... 350k and more dark options. That's great. That's banging. Oh, I got a ton of runes. I'm just going to sell them to the NPC. I don't really want them. Hello, Nipk. Also, I was doing that for so long, I got combat 13. And... Almost combat 14. Two thirds of the way to combat 14. Uh, I want to get some dragon armor. I'm going to be a mage, so I want wise dragon armor. I need combat 16. And. Alright, so that's going to take a while. I guess I get started on the. Oh, nah, 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 nah. Alright. Sam's here. Hey, Sam. Oh, okay, I teleported. I'm just going to collect these minions. Grab this. Alright, I think I've done a lot this episode. And I think it's time to wrap it up. So, it was a good one. And I hope you all enjoyed. And I hope this uploads in less than like 6 hours like the last one did. Um... And yeah, I guess, see ya.